drive determination and consistency. Um, I say those are the three most powerful tools to um, push a team through adversity, winning, losing, and it's a mental game. So my background, obviously I'm from Australia, um, so my background influences my approach a little bit different. In Australia, it's really focused about giving everybody a fair go, and I feel like America's a little bit more competition-based and incentives-based, but in Australia it's a lot more about everybody giving their best try, everybody having a go. And so for me, that's kind of how I approach sports in the aspect that, you know, I want everybody to be involved. I want all my teammates to enjoy their sport and have fun. And I don't want everybody, anybody left behind. Coming from a different country gives me a unique perspective on tennis and teamwork. In many countries, the approach to tennis may vary in terms of training techniques, coaching styles, or even cultural significance of the sport. For me, this international background has instilled adaptability and resilience. I am more open to diverse strategies and learning opportunities because I understand that there is no single right way to play tennis or train. This also extends into how I interact with my teammates. I place a strong emphasis on communication and collaboration since I've experienced how important it is to bridge cultural gaps. So leveling the playing field for me um, in the NCAA obviously it's a little bit hard because you know different schools have different budgets and stuff like that but in my opinion I think it's given everybody the same opportunity to do the same things. Um, I think there should be no incidents where a different sport or a different school doesn't have access to the same things as, a, as another school would. Um, I think everybody should have an opportunity to do whatever they desire if other people are given that same opportunity and they're at the level where they can do it as well. To create an inclusive environment uh, that celebrates the differences um, of each individual player that encourages and acknowledges each person's backgrounds. Um, I also feel like not only will that level the playing field but also promote social cohesion. Leveling the playing field in the NCAA means ensuring that athletes, regardless of their background, have equal opportunities to succeed. This goes beyond providing the same resources. It's about recognizing the unique challenges different groups may face. For instance, athletes from underdeveloped programs, international students, or those balancing academic and financial pressures should receive additional support to thrive. Leveling the playing field should also involve promoting gender equality, addressing racial disputes, and creating an environment where mental health and well-being are prioritized as much as physical performance.